The immunotherapy agents right now are not affecting surgery. That being said, if they come up as viable alternatives to patients with BCG unresponsive or BCG refractory non-muscle maze bladder cancer, then that would lead to surgery being used later in those patients rather than earlier. Right now, the treatment paradigm is someone who has failed BCG, um, then the next best option typically is cystectomy. But if we get a viable option through immunotherapy, then cystectomy will be down the line. I think the biggest uh, unmet need right now is finding an alternative to BCG or finding something which is a good option after patients have failed BCG. Um, a lot of patients who need cystectomy initially start with non-muscle invasive bladder cancer, but they fail intravesical therapy and uh, while they're getting intravesical therapy, the disease progresses to become muscle invasive and then they require cystectomy. So if we can get more effective options to either enhance BCG or replace BCG or be an option after BCG, then uh, that would uh, really help our patients avoid a morbid surgery or uh, its alternatives.